This was the scene at Vancouver's Rickshaw Theatre. About 400 people packed in for the release of a new compilation album. But it's not just about music. This album has a political purpose, to help raise money to support a pipeline protest. Tiny House Warriors, Our Land is Home, is a resistance project created by Sequetmic activist Kanahus Manuel. This project started with Rick Buckman Co. traveling to visit the, the site of the Tiny House Warrior build. Manuel's vision is to build 10 tiny mobile homes that will peacefully block construction of the Trans Mountain Pipeline through Sequetmic territory. How this got started was really coming together in some really you know, st strategic um, think tanks with other women to talk about how are we going to stop this pipeline? How are we going to defend our lands? And it just seemed like the, one of the best ideas ever. Each tiny house, including the trailer it sits on, costs approximately $10,000. The fourth house is currently under construction, but Manuel still needs to raise money for the last six homes. And that's where Rick Buckman Co. comes in. I got a call from a friend saying, hey, you're in Kamloops, you should go check out the Tiny House Warriors. So it just happened to work, and they were amazing. We really loved the whole idea and the concept. Co brought together 40 like-minded artists from all across North America to contribute. They were like, we, we want to have a compilation album and maybe a, a festival. And we're like, that sounds great. And 40 artists later. These artists put you know, their heart and soul into this music for us, for the people. And those are prayers. Those are powerful prayers for our land, to protect our land. Caleb Hart, who calls himself an artivist, says he's proud to be a part of this movement. I am a lyricist, but somehow I get kind of lost for words when it comes to how honored I feel to be a part of something like this. The Night of Live Music and Album Sales raised $6,500. The album, called Tiny House Warriors Volume 1, is available online at tinyhousewarriors.bandcamp.com. You can purchase the compilation for a minimum donation of $10. All proceeds will support the protest. Lori Hamlin, APTN National News, Vancouver.